Rumors are that allegedly Cynthia's family is devastated over this new development. What is it? Well, I have some new information that may answer that question and more right after this. What's up, Kim Folk, and welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, do me a favor and subscribe. And if you already are subscribed, do me a favor and get notified so you'll know whenever I upload new videos to the channel. All right, Kim Folk, come on into the house. We have a lot to talk about, and it centers around rumors that allegedly Cynthia's family is devastated by this new development. What is it? Well, I have some new information that may answer that question and more. And here it goes. Rumors are that Cynthia's family's worst fears have been confirmed. A source said, It's not like they were shocked by the news. They were just disappointed by Cynthia's disregard for her self-worth. The source continued, Those close to Cynthia allegedly thought by backing away from the situation that Cynthia would come to her senses. It appears she has not. The source said, Initially, her family's plan to fall back and allow Cynthia to make her own decisions seemed to be working. However, once her family saw that their backing away resulted in Cynthia doing the opposite, it was too late, ended the source. Again, said another source, Cynthia's family understands that she is an adult capable of making decisions on her own. However, continued the source, many people don't know that behind the scenes, Cynthia has always relied heavily on her family's opinions, directions, and guidance in her life to help her make even the smallest decisions. So, the question is, what changed? Well, allegedly, Producers of Real Housewives of Atlanta had a very heavy hand in getting Peter and Cynthia back together. And of course, Cynthia's family isn't too happy about it. An industry insider said, Cynthia is smart, and I highly doubt she would go back to a dysfunctional relationship with Peter unless it was for a good reason. The insider speculates that Cynthia entertaining a reconcile with Peter Thomas could just be a stunt for TV cameras, and allegedly it may be at the urging of Real Housewives of Atlanta producers. Another industry insider said, some of, some of Cynthia's most iconic moments either were centered around her marriage to Peter or drama adjacent to Peter. And for Peter's part, he was a great producing partner with Cynthia, someone who knew her like a book. It's all speculation, said the insider, but I could see Real Housewives of Atlanta producers trying to recreate that magic. But at what cost to Cynthia? The insider ended by saying, Other than her divorce to Mike, Cynthia is going to need some more meat on her storyline bones if she wants her old peach back. And Peter seems to be the perfect fit for the mission. All sources agree, whether Cynthia is actually with Peter for a storyline or a real second shot at love is all still very devastating to her family. They want what's best for Cynthia and feel that Peter isn't the best fit for her. They want the old, independent, successful, and confident Cynthia to stick around more and not have her revert back to a shell of herself the way she was when she was married to Peter. Now, Kim, folk, you know, um, when this uh, news came across my desk that allegedly Cynthia's family was devastated about this new recent development, um, I could very well see why. And it's because of this. Up until recently, um, the speculation that Peter and Cynthia was pretty much rumors, um, alleged information, speculation. You know, even when Cynthia, you know, hinted at her going back home to Peter and things of that nature or being very core in interviews, a lot of people started to notice that maybe Cynthia and Peter, Peter could be actually getting back together, but there was never really any hardcore proof or evidence. It was all just hearsay. 
And so normally times, things like that would probably just fall on Deb's ear. However, in the midst of Cynthia getting a divorce from Mike and Cynthia uh, regaining some more ca camera time in front of the Real Housewives of Atlanta producers, it seems that these rumors, although still far-fetched at the time, could hold some weight. However, it wasn't until recently when uh, fans of Real Housewives of Atlanta noticed that at Lake Bailey when uh, Cynthia posts, I think it was in a, uh, a sponsorship picture or something to that effect, outside when they zoomed in behind the scenes and saw the reflection in the camera of who was taking the picture it was no other than peter thomas now with that being said this appears to be the first confirmation and the first sighting of the two together which gives a whole new credence to these rumors that cynthia and peter are trying to rekindle their relationship it seems now that he's back at lake belly and may be back in cynthia's good graces which leads us to the rumor that her family is allegedly devastated by her rekindling her old relationship with Peter. Now, Kim folk, um, I can understand why um, Cynthia's family could be allegedly uh, frustrated and devastated by this news. Um, and it's because of this reason. As my sources were saying, that allegedly Cynthia's family wants her to remain that single, sexy, successful, and confident uh, Cynthia that they have always grown to love and always knew. And only want her to get back in a relationship or marriage if they feel like the person she's marrying is uh, accommodating her lifestyle, contributes to her lifestyle, and falls in a place organically with who Cynthia is as a real person. And to see her going back to a person that, um, you know, allegedly was not a good fit for her and allegedly was bad for business, um, I can understand why they're upset with that. Because at this point, Cynthia has tried marriage not once, but twice. And I'm not sure if she was married to Leon, but just for the sake of the argument, she has gone through three very public relationships and all have ended. And it seems as if that her family may just really be ready for Cynthia just to be single for a while, to enjoy herself, to enjoy life, to enjoy the fruits of her labor, her success, and her daughter's growth, and also just to be that confident person who they know and have grown to love and wants to see the best for. And Kim folk, I will admit, I too was a little bit disappointed seeing Cynthia back with Peter. Now, who am I to say their relationship was not good? We don't know how many bad moments they had or how many good moments they had. All we got was four to five minute segments each week. However, I just feel like the way that it ended and sequentially the things they went through after the divorce ended, it just seems as if Peter just not a good fit for Cynthia professionally or personally. However, I can see the personal part. Maybe they could be just friends, but I'd highly doubt that. And the reason why I highly doubt that maybe Cynthia and Peter could just be doing better as friends and not necessarily in a relationship um, is because of this reason. Peter Thomas, um, as a friend, we don't know how he is as a friend to Cynthia, but let's just say for the sake of the argument that he is a uh, good friend to Cynthia and she enjoys hanging out with him and being around him and being his company. Okay, fine. But when you think about her being a friend to Peter um, and also getting back on Real Housewives of Atlanta right now as a friend of the show and allegedly looking to be um, a, a new peach holder, um, a, friend of the a friend of the show with hanging out with a friend is not exactly the storyline that I think producers are want to see about and hear about. And I feel like that it's only going to work as if they're in a true relationship. Um, I don't think the magic that Peter and Cynthia had um, as friends is what producers like. Or I don't think that the relationship that Peter and Cynthia uh, had as friends um, after the divorce is really what the fans want to see. The magic to Cynthia and Peter was their defunction in marriage. Unfortunately, it was a defunction that got people talking. They got the eyes on the cameras. They got them the, the, the center of a lot of conversation about married life, about mixing business with pleasure. And that would make them, that's what made them interesting as a couple, not the whole friend dynamic. So, you know, even if Cynthia and, and uh, Peter are just friends, I think that's going to be very hard to pull off. Uh, for the simple fact of the matter is that the magic, if you are to believe what the uh, sources were saying, 
was pretty much in how Peter was helping produce Cynthia in their marriage and seeing the inside of their marriage dynamic for what it really was. Sometimes a circus and sometimes a complete and utter, and utter mess. But with that being said, I do feel like, you know, uh, that is the only true way for Cynthia to enter, re-enter to the Housewife universe as a peach holder is if she's married to Peter because married Peter and Cynthia is where the magic lies. Now, Kim Folk, this is the last part of this rumor that I do find very interesting um, when I was talking to my sources, and it's this. You know, it's very fun and very exciting to see Peter and Cynthia allegedly back together. The rumor mirrors are talking. People are excited to see what's going on behind the scenes. But one of my sources pointed out that for all intents and purposes, even though Peter offers that old school vintage nostalgia, nostalgia that we have for Real Housewives when Lanta when Cynthia first got on the show, it may no longer be there with the fans. And one of the sources pointed out that, you know, even though Peter was not on Real Housewives of Atlanta last season, he was on Real Housewives of Potomac this season. And his appearance on this show got horrible reviews. Um, fans of both franchises felt that Peter was just completely out of control, unhinged, and very disrespectful to Dr. Wendy when talking about, and very unprofessional with Dr. Wendy in talking about going, in, going into business with her. Um, a lot of fans felt that he had not matured. A lot of fans found out what he did was very immature, very messy, and very unwarranted. And my sources are saying that if you are to look at the social media metrics of Peter's performance on Real Housewives of Potomac, it doesn't bode well for him potentially returning to the Real Housewives of Atlanta franchise. Simply because those are two franchises that have crossover fans. So if fans weren't feeling him on Real Housewives of Potomac, they may not be feeling him on Real Housewives of Atlanta, whether he's adjacent to Cynthia or not. So that's one heard that my sources are saying that Peter may be facing if he is trying to be Cynthia's love interest or friend or friend of the show with Cynthia on this upcoming season or next season. He's going to have to rehabilitate his uh, reputation for my sources are saying that had almost been completely rehabilitated until he got on Real Housewives of Potomac and pulled that stunt with Wendy <clears throat> and Mia and caused them to have this big blowout. But Kim folk. I'm considering all this information because right now it's alleged information and speculation. Um, but if Peter and um, Cynthia are back together, do you think their family has a right to be devastated by this news? Or do you think her family just should wash their hands with it once for all, step back and let Cynthia and Peter be, and Peter be adults? Let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. All right, Kim folk, as always, if you enjoyed this video, please like, share, subscribe, and comment. And I'll see you guys over in the next one. Peace.